watch this video, you are agreeing to relieve United Taps and its staff of any liability for injuries or damages caused by watching or attempting any of the movements presented in this video. If you do not agree to this, please discontinue watching this video now. Thank you. Hi, I'm Rod from UnitedTaps.com. You're about to watch and learn an intermediate tap combination to the song Wanted a Name by Friendship. Uh, before we take a look at it, be sure to click on the link below to get access to our intermediate premium package. Tons of great content for you. We've got a huge series of lessons. We've got a dictionary. We've got choreography. We've got a workout across the floor, practice exercises, just a ton of stuff to keep you tapping and having fun. So click on that link below and to get access to all that. All right, let's take a look. Could you love me like you used to? break this down. Starting with the right foot, you have step shuffle, step shuffle, heel shuffle, heel. Again, go. One and a two and a three and a four. From here, two double alternating cramp rolls. A one and a two, a three and a four. Again, those double alternating cramp rolls, they are a lap step, heel, heel, a lap step, heel, heel. Super, my friends. Let's connect it from the top. Six, seven, Eight, one and a two and a three and a four, a five and a six, a seven and a eight. Let's do it a couple more times and work our speed up a bit. Six, seven, eight. Step shuffle, step shuffle, heel shuffle, heel, double alternating, double alternating and faster. Six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four, a five and a six, a seven and a eight. All right, this next part is probably the most difficult part in the whole combination. It's not because we're doing like some kind of weird hard wing or pullback thing. It's just getting the timing right. The footwork is stamp, step, spank, step. Again, that's stamp, step, spank, step. Same thing, left foot. Stamp, step, spank, step, and then stamp, stamp. I know, so far it doesn't seem too tricky. I'll do it again. Stamp, step, spank, step. Stamp, step, spank, step. Stamp, stamp. Let's do it again without a pause. Ready, go. Stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, stamp. Again, go. Stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, stamp. Now the part where this gets tricky is when we put the counts to it and we see what the real rhythm is. And this is how it goes. One and a two and a three and a four. All right, so we're sort of doing a triplet-ish type of rhythm, da 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 And when we think of that triplet rhythm, it's, it's, it's like in groups of threes. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, uh, right? But this step is, is mostly in fours and twos. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. Three, four, one, two. So when we take a step that's normally, that we normally group in fours and twos, and we put it into a rhythm that's grouped in threes, it gets a little tricky. You're like, well, the step on its own is not that hard, but doing this rhythm is challenging, and it's because you've got a step with four sounds, um, putting it into a rhythm that works primarily in divisions of three. So we're going we're gonna to do that all again, exactly what I just did with the proper counts. Seven, eight, one and a two and a three and a four. Six, ready, go. One and a two and a three and a four. Faster, six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Again, six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Now, some of you may be getting this saying, hey, this doesn't seem hard at all, Rod. But you may find coming from the steps before it, when you get to this step, you're not going to want to do it in that triplet. You're going to go like one and two and three, four, or one and two and three and four and five, six, instead of one and a two and a three and a four. So let's connect it from the top and see if we can get some flow into that. Six, seven, eight, one and a two and a three and a four, a five and a six, a seven and a eight, one and a two and a three and a four. Why, yes, we'll do it again. Five, six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. A five and a six, a seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four. From here, step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, dig, dig, dig. 
Again, that's step, strength, heel, step, strength, heel, step, strength, heel, dig, dig, dig. Um, you can say draw back, draw back, one, draw back, two, draw back, three, dig, dig, dig. Or if you're like me and you start draw back with a spank, you can say step, draw back, one, draw back, two, spank, heel, dig, dig, dig. I don't care how you put it in your head as long as you get the feet right. So let's connect the stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, step, spank, step, stamp, stamp, with step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, dig, dig, dig. We'll put those all together. Six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a. Again, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a. Super, my friends. Let's take a top and connect it all together. Six, ready, go. One and a two and a three and a four. A five and a six. A seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a. Of course, we're going to do that again. Same thing a few more times to get you comfortable. If you do have it down and it's easy for you, add some style. Six, seven, eight. One and a two and a three and a four. A five and a six. A seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a. One more time. Six, ready, go. One and a two and a three and a four. A five and a six. A seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a. From here, toes clap, clap, heels clap, clap, toes clap, clap, heels. Again, that is toes clap, clap, heels clap, clap, toes clap, clap, heels. From here, you have step, shuffle, step, big toe, step, big toe, stamp. You gotta do that again. That is step, shuffle, step, big toe, step, big toe, stamp. Now let's go back from toes, clap, clap with counts. Six, seven, eight, one and a two and a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Yes, we'll do it again. Six, ready, go. Toes, clap, clap, heels, clap, clap, toes, clap, clap, heels. Step, shuffle, step, big toe, step, big toe, stamp. Let's put a little more speed on it. Six, seven, eight, one and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. Yes again. Six. Ready? Go. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. From here. Shuffle, dig, dig toes. Shuffle, dig, dig toes. There we go. <laughs> Again, seven, eight. Shuffle, dig, dig toes. Shuffle, dig, dig toes. Your counts are a one and a two. A three and a four. To finish it out, you have dig heel, toe heel, dig heel, toe heel, dig heel. Again, that's dig heel, toe heel, dig heel, toe heel, dig heel. So there's three dig heels, but only two toe heels. Again, ready, go. Dig heel, toe heel, dig heel, toe heel, dig heel. And your counts for that are five and a six and a seven and a eight. Now we have another situation where we're doing a step that's primarily done in either twos or fours. Like if you're breaking it down as a big heel, that's a two, a toe heel's a two. So that's a two, a two, a two, a two, a two. Or maybe you're breaking it into fours. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and then a two. Just like this was, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and then a two. However, we're taking that, that step that your brain wants to group in twos or fours, and we're putting it into a rhythm that groups things in threes, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Same concept here. You're getting a second chance at it. All right, so let's do that dig heel, toe heel at the end with the right rhythm. Six, ready, go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. Again, go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. One more time. Go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. That is coming out of shuffle, dig, dig toes, shuffle, dig, dig toes, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Let's try, take it from those shuffle, dig, dig toes. I'll put all the counts on. Six, seven, eight, a one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Why, well, certainly we'll do it again. Six, ready, 
go. A one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. One more time. Six. Ready. Go. A one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Now here's the tricky part. This shuffle, dig deep toes, shuffle, dig deep toes. You have to be thinking ahead because that's coming out of step shuffle, step dig toe, step dig toe, stamp. Get ready to go. Get ready to go. You do get a slight pause before we go into shuffle, dig deep toes, but you want your brain to be there ahead of time because if you're caught off guard, that shuffle, dig dig toes is not going to happen. <laughs> so let's practice the transition from. Step shuffle, step big toe, step big toe, stamp two, shuffle, big big toes, shuffle, big big toes, five and a six and a seven and a eight. We'll connect all those pieces. Six, ready, go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight, a one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. You bet we're doing it again. Same thing. Six, ready, go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. One more time, same thing. Six, ready, go. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Super. Now I'm going to rewind just a little bit more, and we're going to go back to toes, clap, clap, heels, clap, clap, toes, clap, clap, heels. Step shuffle, step deep toe, step deep toe, stamp. Shuffle, dig, dig both. Shuffle, dig, dig both. Dig heel toe, heel, dig heel toe, heel, dig heel. We're gonna do that whole pattern starting with the toes, clap, clap. I will count you in. Six, ready, go. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. Of course, we're doing it again. Same pattern, toes clap clap. Six, ready, go. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. Awesome. Now, we're gonna go back to top and connect all those pieces together. Now, if you're wondering, hey Rod, what comes before this? It was the Step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, step, spank, heel, dig, 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 toes, clap, clap, heels, clap, clap. So you're already up. You have your toes in the air, which is perfect to set them down into the toes clap. So we kind of prepared you for it. And I'm here the whole time, so if you get lost, just follow my feet. From the top, six, seven, eight. Step, shuffle, step, shuffle, heel, shuffle, heel, double, alternating, double, alternating. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a one and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. Of course, we're doing that all again. That was just our first run through all the way through. It's going to be rough, no worries. We'll smooth it out. Top, six, beginning, go. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six, a seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight and a one and a two and a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. A one and a two, a three and a four. Five and a six and a seven and a eight. We're gonna roll that one more time. Get a little more solid, and then we'll put some music on and see how we do. Top six. Seven, eight, one and a two and a three and a four, a five and a six, a seven and a eight. One and a two and a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight and a one and a two and a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight, a one and a two, a three and a four, five and a six and a seven and a eight. Beautiful, my friends. Let's try with music. And this is to the song Wanted a Name by Friendship. That's which is spelled F R E N and then S H I P. Friendship. And this is, we're coming in at 56 seconds into the song. I'm pretty confident I'm going to be slowing this down. <laughs> so let me um, find a good song. Could you love me like you Yeah, yeah, 
so we're going to start at about 12 and a half percent under tempo. Get used to that. We'll work up maybe then to about 6% and then we'll do real speed. So starting at 12% under, coming in at 56 seconds. Good luck, my friends. Have some fun. Let's see what happens. Five, six, seven, eight. be a little brisk on the first run that's why we're going to do it several more times so you can readjust to this quicker speed here we go top my friends times at this speed and then we'll we'll max out at like minus six percent that'll be our, our maximum speed because it's pretty it's pretty quick expected to go this fast. If you can, great. If you can't, you're normal. <laughs> All right, here we go. Minus six percent, a little quicker. Good luck. time at that speed for my overachievers. Here we go. And five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to do it one more time facing you so you can see what it looks like from the front. You're not expected to do it with me. Uh, it's just so you can see how it looks. All right. If all goes well, we'll see. so much for tapping with me i hope you had a great time with that combination don't for click don't forget to click the link below to get our intermediate premium package again huge set of uh, intermediate lessons uh, we do warm-ups uh, i teach individual steps i break them down slow on the right and left 
I talk about common problems and how to fix them. And then we immediately practice that uh, step over and over and over. And then we put it into a combination so you can get better at it. Then we'll do that for a couple more steps. And at the end of the lesson, we will put all those steps together into a longer combination. So that's the basic um, outline of how the lessons go. It's very logical and cumulative. It builds on itself. Um, so the stuff that you learn in lesson one, you're going to see it again in lesson two, and often again in lesson four and lesson six. The stuff will come back again and again, so you get a chance to reinforce that learning. You're also going to get choreography, across the floor combinations, practice exercise combinations, uh, a level three tap dictionary, so all the steps in level three, broken down, notes, um, counts, the whole, whole nine yards, a workout, just a ton of content. If you click that link below, uh, you can I'll take it there so you can check that out. All right, thanks again for tapping with me. I, of course, am Rod Howe from unitedtaps.com, making you happier and healthier through tap dance.